what is going on y'all welcome to another episode of searching for grinds and good times and i'm finally here grinds to the max for people who don't know i am from hawaii i was born in california but i was three months old long story short i lived in hawaii from 1983 to 2002 and graduated high school there you know elementary the whole thing i keep seeing them on instagram i have to check this out let's go check this out grinds to the max 2016 see right here lemon butter garlic shrimp rare ahi katsu combo shoyu limu bro i haven't had that in so long potato crab salad hawaiian style pokey lao lao kalua pig dynamite chicken katsu oh let's go inside I got the big one. 1872 Mijun, two Hawaiian sons. I like the islands. Actually, so good. I already finished one of the uh, Hawaiian Suns. Anytime I can get some Hawaiian food, being from Hawaii, I gotta try it out. I've been seeing Grind to the Max on Instagram for a long time. I was trying to show you the top. But uh, I got a full meat jun plate. Their macaroni salad has crab and potato in it, which I don't think I've had. I haven't had this in over 20 years, so I'm excited. Let's see what's inside it. I'm going to open this up. It has been 20 years. Basically, it's terry beef, and you have, like, scrambled egg around it, and then they um, fry it. You got two scoops of white rice. Now, this isn't regular macaroni salad. This is crab potato mac salad. I remember trying this. Oh, that's good. 20 years. Let's go. As you see, it's a terry beef. It's got egg. <laughs> Without the sauce first. Just like I remember. Now, this sauce is red. In Hawaii, the sauce is like the color of terry sauce. See, it's a red sauce, so let me see if it's a hot sauce. Usually, it's a terry sauce. All right. Okay. They put a little bit of hot sauce in the terry sauce. It's not hot at all. Tastes fantastic. Wow, that's good. We have kimchi, which is amazing. Kimchi. Oh man, so good. Have a little flavor of the egg. And the beef coming through. Good stuff recommend grind to the max like i said it was my first time um if you're from hawaii or like korean barbecue or just like it's hard to explain it's like scramble egg and a steak together you know there's really no extra sauces to it besides the dipping sauce 
Um, they had everything else there. Um, Terry Beef Place, Chicken Katsu. Now, they have a lot of pokey. Um, poke is like, how do I explain to everybody? The freshest of the freshest you can get. So being in Hawaii, like you catch the fish and you chop it up on the beach and you eat it like sashimi style, like strict poke. So anyways, it's like um, raw fish. They kind of put like, they had the limo in there. They put some seasonings on it, some Hawaiian salt, maybe some shoyu, you know what I mean? Uh, sesame oil, stuff like that, some terry sauce, depending on how you like it, but man, it is so good. Um, I didn't see any taco there, but I also didn't look long enough. There was a lot of people there, so I didn't really want to talk and like bother everybody. It's a big place, but it was packed, so it made it feel really small. Um, they also have diamond head drinks, like you've seen, um, Hawaiian Sun, just so many island favorites. Uh, they also had Lay's in there, and they had uh, Lay's, I think they were like 80 and 75 dollars, but if you've never had a Hawaiian Lay or smell one or experienced one, definitely go up there. Grind Cinemax Max off Russell Road, Las Vegas, Nevada. Um, I will be going back there to try everything. They also had hats for like $20, $25, stickers, stuff like that. Really good experience. Happy I went. I saw them on Instagram and that's what led me there. So until the next time, searching for grinds and good times, I'm happy. See you next time.